Alright guys, uh, this is a video that <clears throat> hopefully uh, by watching this you guys can maybe see what's uh, wrong. I'm trying to put together my uh, HX35 back together. Um, I just rebuilt it, put new journal bearings in there, they spin really nicely. Uh, make sure everything's clean, all oiled up. And when I get the shaft back into the cartridge, um, it spins freely until I tighten down the nut on the compressor wheel and then it will uh, no longer be able to spin by hand which obviously isn't correct so first uh, difference I noticed in the new parts that I got and the old one that came out this is the old collar I don't know if you can see that that goes under the sleeve it's kinda shaped similar to this washer here and this one slides generally easy on and off of the shaft. This is the new one. It's a complete circle. Um, they look like they're about pretty close to the same height. Um, I could put some calipers on them and check that. But this one, as you can see, doesn't go on quite as easily. Um, usually I get a socket in my mallet and pound it down on there. Alright, so uh, now I'm going to put uh, the shaft in and show you guys what's going on. Hopefully you guys can can help me out here. So that's the shaft seated in there. Spins fairly easily. Alright, now it's time for this collar. So, I'm going to put this down for a second. As you can see, that was me. Um, I had to put that collar on there with my socket, my mallet. Alright, next thing that goes on is this thrust washer. It's hard to do this with one hand. So I have that on there, and I've been putting this in kind of as an assembly. Um, this it's got the oil deflector and the uh, I don't know what you call this front collar that also has a compression ring on it, and everything you know that that collar spins pretty freely. Um, and then my seals down in there already. So that just goes on like that, and then all I have to do is put this C clip in here which would probably be pretty hard to do one-handed as well, so I can put you down for another second. Alright, and the C-clip is back in there now. So, um... Set this up somewhere. Um, as you should be able to see here, this uh, shaft spins pretty freely right now. Right, kind of in and out a little bit. And I'll put this compressor wheel on. And I'm just going to tighten it by hand. You can 
see how much harder that spins. That's not even torqued down at all. Um, if I were to just put a little bit into it. All of a sudden, I can hardly spin it by hand as it is. So, uh, I hope this helps. Maybe you guys can give me some ideas of what I might be doing wrong, or maybe a wrong part I have, or, um, you know, something else that's messed up. Um, if you guys just get back to me as soon as possible, I'd appreciate it. Thanks.